Arius. Why is the sound like that? That's kind of weird. Hmm. My audio levels are stuck at really high for some reason. Don't know why. <clears throat> I'm kind of losing my voice. Sorry about that. So yes, this is Vampire. And uh, Dracula asks you, why pay more? <laughs> Indeed, why pay more? This is a this was a probably referring to the fact that it's a sort of budget title, budget game type thing. That's weird as well today. Sorry, everything looks weird. I know my top looks weird as well. Because I'm going for a run a bit later. And yeah, this is Vampire for the Commodore 64. And yesterday, let's just speed this up, shall we? There we go. Good. I love this music. I love this theme tune. Beautiful. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, let's get the mouse out of the way. So yes, yesterday we played this. No, oh, not yesterday, sorry. Um, oh, was it yesterday? I went to the gym yesterday. I think this was... I think I just played this before I went to the gym. And... Uh, and it bugged out. It bugged out. We got really far further than I've ever been <laughs> as a youngster. But it seems like there's a second section of the game which you have to do in a certain order. And if you don't do it in that specific order, then it bugs the game out where you can't pick up some items. <clears throat> I'm really losing my voice. <clears throat> So, yeah, let's do it again, and this time, hopefully, I haven't checked, but let's hopefully um, do things in a slightly different order. We should be able to pick up the items. Ooh, that ain't good. <laughs> it's going to take me a little bit to get warmed up to this game again, I think, as well. <laughs> of course, uh... This is Dracula's castle, you can tell, because he's plastered bloody pictures of himself all over the place. Don't know who took the photo, or whatever. And, uh... <laughs> there are a number of things we have to do. There's a top half and a bottom half. And the bottom half... Sorry, the top half, which is what we're in right now, in the top of this castle. Um... We gotta open the doors, and we have to go collect some keys. And Dracula, thankfully, has left tons of food lying around his castle because I guess he only eats, he only drinks blood, and he doesn't eat hamburgers or fish or chickens. So he leaves them. I don't know for the rats, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> thankfully, we can eat those. And uh, uh, no, I mentioned before. I just love the aesthetics of this game. There's just something about it. Oh, no, no, no. There's something about the aesthetics of this game that I just absolutely adore. The graphics with the sort of... Everything has a single color. Um, the sound effects. Like, even the tap, tap, tapping of this... Whether it's a knight in shining armor or whatever it is. It doesn't really bother me, you know? It's like... All the sound effects are nice. The lasers which Dracula has conveniently installed into his castle. High-tech lasers. Ah, oh, this ain't good. Ah, I couldn't have jumped over there because of those candles. <clears throat> so yes, there is a lot of food in this game, but it's all in the second half, and I've just forgotten that I should have gone and get gotten the extra food, shouldn't I? But I haven't gotten the extra food, so we might be having a death quite early on in this place. You can see the lives at the bottom, bottom left, one life. And we have a square key. Jump over there. I can do a small jump, I can do a big jump. And now we have a circle key. Oof. Not good. Not good. These arrows kinda suck. It's not a good place to be either. I need a bit of... So we're not going up there. There's, a, there's an alternative route to get up there, which we found out last time. Never finished this game as a kid. It's a little bit tricky. This is a tricky one. 
Oof, almost got hit by that as well. Mm, you know what? I am going to go down here and get the extra lives. <clears throat> get the extra food. Because <clears throat> it's not too far away. But we did work out that this is actually not the right way to go currently. Need to finish up the upper half. This leads to the catacombs, the bottom half. The underground. And uh, another thing I love is the enemy design. The enemies are just wild in this game. Just absolutely nuts. Ooh. That was... Amateur. <laughs> that was amateur. Right, well, the situation we have here is we have a dining table, and there's a chicken under the dining table. A hidden chicken. Castlevania-like, almost. And we don't know why, but our hero, in his suit of armor, or whether he's an alien, we don't know. Um, he is tiny. He is a little guy compared to everything else in this game. And here we have the first of falling blocks, which will remove an entire life if you get hit by them. Luckily, we've sort of worked out now where all of these falling blocks are. <clears throat> and there we go, we got a triangle key. We're making okay progress, but there's going to be a difficult... There's about to be a very difficult section. <clears throat> Let me tell you. And uh, the speed at which we get through this difficult section will be the... Uh, will sort of make or break our game, really. Three lives. Dracula loves his vitamins, so he leaves bananas around the place as well. Because why not? I know I would leave bananas around the place if I was Dracula. And here's the difficult section that I just mentioned. You can see that top, <clears throat> that, uh, that top platform right there. You have to time it exquisitely. And all, all at the same time. Like now, Yes, yes, yes. No. Thought I had that. Can't jump this one. All this time, you just have to keep getting hit by this. Yes, this is perfect. Perfect. Yes. That was actually really good. We got up there pretty damn fast. <clears throat> Flick that. And now we have a cross. Which we need. Everyone knows you need a cross and you want to kill, go kill Dracula. So there we go. <clears throat> okay, this one is safe. Let's wait for everything to get lost and then we'll make our way over these ramparts, I guess they are. Okay. Another window to open here. And our lives are slowly ticking down, but we're not that bad actually. I think I think we should be okay. I believe we're almost done with this upper section. We go and there are some falling blocks they look like spikes but you can actually stand on these ones we found out which is a bit weird but there you go love the noise i love that noise when the door opens can't even do it and here is a scroll of some kind <clears throat> 
the spell. Dracula, of course, as you've seen, loves to hide things in the tops of his towers. Don't really know why. And then we need to jump on this enemy. And we've done everything. This is everything we need to do in this, and this is where we were previously. We've cleared out the top part of this game. I would love to see a complete map of this. <laughs> see what it actually looks like when it's all built. I'm too lazy to take screenshots though. Okay. So now we will delve beneath the castle and we will collect items in a very specific order. That does not mess us up. Ooh. Okay, jump on this. Now. There we go. And I love that little enemy down there. What is that? What are you? You bit of dust? No clue. Anyways, <laughs> down we go. Down we go. And I will happily take that chicken. But there's a spike. Nice suit of armor there as well. Got some acid on the floor. And yes, you can see there are a variety of complete death traps. So if you fall down any of these, I don't think you can get out. So you need to be very careful getting past those coffins. And here's where we put the scroll in. Don't know what this bit of paper represents, but uh, it is a key, effectively. Ah, no. And now we're in the catacombs. Don't know why I waited. Okay, this is the this is the labyrinth right here, and previously we went down first, and we're not gonna do that this time. We're gonna go up. And as you can see, Dracula has Dracula is a midnight snacker because he's clearly put he's hidden all of the food very far away so no one can see he's a big old fatty really. <laughs> He's got tacos, he's got... He's got chickens, he's got fish. All stashed away. Look, there's another one. Now, I, can't, I think this way is just food. <clears throat> but for the sake of completion... Completionism? We'll take a look. Take a look over here. Uh, no, actually, this is not food. And that is a very dangerous death pit, as you can probably tell. What is over here? Oh, that thing. I don't know. Nah, I'm not collecting that yet. I'll come back for that. I've got no idea what that is, actually. We'll get that later. For now, I'm looking for a very specific item that we needed to <clears throat> unlock a door, which is the Bible. We're looking for the Bible. Of course we are. Of those Dracula teeth enemies. There's something about this game which is just sort of very atmospheric in a way that the vast majority of other games, especially Commodore 64 games, are not. I don't know what it is, you, you sort of feel, even though the colours are a bit crazy, right? You sort of feel drawn into it. Or maybe it's just me, and I'm a lunatic. <laughs> could be. It could be. There we go, six. You see the, uh, <laughs> sorry, the lives there is zero, six, but actually, um... You can only get a maximum of nine lives. I don't know why the zero is even there. You cannot get ten lives. I don't think you can get ten lives. 
Right, this is the this is the chicken place. Whoa! Might as well stock up on some food, even though there's absolute tons of it lying around in this place. Uh, I don't know if I should go for that though. That looks like Nah, I'm not gonna go for that one. Don't know if I can jump back up there. I like that. That's sort of like a Dracula sort of noise, right? And I think... Yeah, it is. Okay, yeah. So here is the Bible. And last time, if you watched the stream last night, uh, or yesterday afternoon, we couldn't pick this up. <laughs> and now we can. There we go. Sweet. Now I just need to remember where this bloody door is. Because I cannot remember for the life of me. Let's go up here as well. Uh, shall we grab some fishies? Let's grab some fishies, shall we? Can only grab one, I think. There we go. There's our nine lives. So we don't need to be in this area anymore. I'm not going to pick up that cog yet. Because once again, I'm not sure what that is. That weird sort of nut type thing. And I don't want to fill up the... Uh, I don't want to fill up my inventory with stuff. <clears throat> Until I've opened this door at least. <clears throat> So let's go to the left. Down we go. Get some more delicious food, which we cannot grab. Food all over the place right now. this as quick as we can. Enough food to run through some stuff, I think. I'll pick that up either. Got some hidden, hidden uh, arrow guns. Dracula's getting clever. Now, I can't remember which way to go at this point either. Uh, maybe we just go this way first. I think this way is where the door is. I kind of want to open that first. Now these little, little doodahs also can kill you, if you can believe that or not. Like that, even though it was nowhere near me. I love how Dracula creates, like, rainbow stairs. What a pretty staircase. Thank you, Dracula. Okay, let's go this way. Got a lovely hamburger to pick up. We have another choice. Whew. Let's go up. Tons of food. And even more food. More food than you can possibly eat. Can we get out here? Yes, we can. Good. Another 
another choice to make. Yeah, to be fair, I was a bit close to that one. Didn't hit me, but I was a bit close. Now we have an... Now we have another rainbow staircase. Just a slightly bigger one. There we go. Really don't need this amount of health game. Ah, we found it. Okay. Great. We haven't been this way before. So let's see what is going on. Do I need to jump up here? Maybe we go see first. Oh no. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. Oh, here's a low one. Okay. So those platforms to the left don't make a lot of sense. <clears throat> the only way is up, baby. Let's go. Am I just going to jump now and hope that... Hmm. Something tells me this is going to be a very difficult bit of the game. I got a feeling. Okay, well, these ones shouldn't be so difficult to get on. Okay, I guess we jump over here now. Yes, we do. Oh my god, there's a second level of platforms. Okay. I do not like this. I can walk onto this one. Oh! Walked. <laughs> it took me anyways. Okay. Oop. Oh, man. Okay, looks like we're almost reaching the top of this. This one's a little tricky. I'm going to go here. Whoop. <laughs> this is more difficult. I'm, I'm making this look slightly easy, but it, it ain't. Oh my god. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Who designed this? Who designed this crap? Oh my god. Oh, okay. <clears throat> this has to be a joke. This has to be a joke. Ah, I should have waited. This, this is going to take a few of my lives, I believe. Okay, now the platform is literally just moving with the bat. Oh, guys. Okay, go, go, go. Okay. How much we can do apart from eat that? Okay. Okay. Oof. Hate it when you go off screen. You can't really see what's going on. The platforms all below below you kind of stop. Okay, this one we can just walk on again. And then good. Okay. This one this one's really is this where we got the nope. It must be the next screen. Is the next screen. I think I can just skip that one, can't I? Yep. Oh my god, please let it be over. Please let the platforms be over. Oh no. Oh no, there's more. There are more platforms. What's this one? Oh my god. Gideon. Look at this. Oh, Jesus. Okay. 
Okay. No! Oh, well, at least we have like these platforms to look, look forward to. I'm starting to get low on lives though. This is insanity. Oh no, can it? That one I need to jump at exactly the right time. Now. Yeah, okay. Good. Not sure I'm gonna get we need to wait a little while, I think, for this one. There we go. Oh yes, 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 yes. Haha. <laughs> ha. <laughs> Game's not even trying now, just put a freaking gun emplacement with nothing behind it. And now a bubble. <laughs> Alright, what's next? We have a cross key. I haven't seen a cross door, but we have a cross key. Okay, but we have a big gap. Should I just jump it? Oh! No, 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 no. I don't like this. Oh! Oh my god, do we have to do this to get up here? Are you serious? How game? Okay. So when you jump, you can actually stop in midair, so like that. Whoa, that was difficult. Now we have a cross key, but I haven't seen a cross door, which may cause problems. <clears throat> we will find out soon enough. Why do I get the feeling I should jump there? Okay. We saw a lot of food, right? But uh, it's probably like on a separate platform somewhere. Anyways, let's get out of here. Plot thickens because I have not seen a door with a cross, I don't think. Unless I'm forgetting something. Do you want to grab some extra health though? Top our lives up. I really don't want to play this again. This that that section again, because that section was brutal. Pew pew. Pew. Down we go. And let's head this way, I guess. Why not? Now I remember this area. This falls down so that we can get up there later. <clears throat> Excuse me, Mr. Skeleton. Uh, I, I thought maybe I could outrun it, but I wasn't even close, was I? Okay, let's go up here. And here's the hammer. Now, okay, so I remember this is the other item that for the life of us, we just could not pick up. And now we can. Okay, great. <coughs> Fantastic. So the only other thing that we haven't picked up yet, which we do need to pick up, is the stake. Because you need a hammer and a stake. I think this is probably much everything we need, right? You need a cross. You need a hammer. You need a stake. And you can finally put up the IKEA furniture. This place is done. <clears throat> was there just food up here? I do feel like going up and getting some food. There was tons of it. Delicious food. 
There we go, back up to seven lives. Screw the fish. Don't like it anyways. A more chicken sort of guy. Okay. Oh god. We need to sort on my hair, you know. This is now a hair stream. Because you know why? I'm trying to get the 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 sort of long center parting. Think uh, Tom Cruise in Vanilla Sky, just without the face. <laughs> just with a much worse face. But uh, last time I got a cut, it wasn't cut very well. So now it's sort of a bit crappy. I'm very self-conscious about it. Usually I'm not so self-conscious, but right now I'm very self-conscious about it. I know, right? First world problems. Okay, let's go this way. There we go. And yes, we have to jump on the little cute puffer fish. Which for some reason Dracula keeps puffer fish around. There we go. And I probably shouldn't have gone in at that point. Apparently I got hit by that. Now remember these don't actually... F okay, that one does fall on you. Sorry. I thought all of them didn't fall on me, but there we go. They do. That's how good my memory is these days. So we need to go this way. These things really, really fall in a weird way. Okay. Yep. Now I don't. That looks to me like a complete and utter trap. So I'm, I wouldn't wouldn't go for that even if I wanted to. This on the other hand looks like delicious food. There we go. Tons of it. And there's the steak. And hopefully we can pick it up. Otherwise, we might be screwed. <sighs> we're screwed! Yay! Well, I think we're screwed. <laughs> I mean, surely we need the stake to kill Dracula, don't we? Does that mean we don't need the... Oh, wait, wait. Do we use the key first and then we grab the stake? Maybe that's what we do. Maybe we need to find the... Maybe we need to find where we put this key, but we've explored the entirety of... We've explored the entirety of this place, haven't we? Hmm. What else is there to explore around here? What's to the right of here? I can't remember. Oh, no, this is the... yeah. We've explored this entire place. Uh... Okay, now... now we are at a complete mystery, okay? So... The entirety of the catacombs is explored, I guess. Maybe that jumping area, we could have explored that a bit more. But... So what do we do now? Do we go and check the top part of the castle again for maybe something we missed? And then we have to come back down in the catacombs a second time? To pick up the stake?
Okay, you need to jump out of this. Oh, this is tricky. There we go. Let's try and find this, where this key goes then. Do, 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 do. <laughs> okay. This is one crazy castle, Dracula. Alright, there's nothing here. Let's keep our eyes open. Here. Hmm. There's nothing here. What I do recognize is that the game does provide a complete and comprehensive way to get out of this place. Hmm. Maybe go this way instead. Yeah. Nothing over there. Of course, there's no food. Uh, there's no food. The other thing that sort of leans me towards coming back up here is that there's a ton of food down below, but there isn't really any food up here, which means that you restock up down below and then you you go for it. There's nothing here, right? This is just where we got one of the keys. Guess we have to recheck. Looking for exits. Looking for something. Ah, oh, this can't be it. Yeah, it's just where we got the key. Maybe up. You know what? Now that I think about it, I seem to remember there was... There was another door somewhere around here that did actually have the cross key. That we saw yesterday. But I can't remember for the life exactly where it was. Ah! Maybe I do remember where it was. Maybe it's actually up there. But can we get up there? Aha! Found it. My god, look at this death. Okay. Up we go. We've got more doors to open. Starting to run out of health here. I think the better way to go up would be this way, yeah. <clears throat> Is this like the main tower? Okay, got a bookcase. I'm going to see what's up here first. Whoa! Okay, we found Dracula, but we can't do anything with Dracula. I guess we need the stake. So now we're going to go all the way back down to the catacombs. Grab the stake, hopefully grab the stake. I mean, if we can't, then I don't know. Then the only thing I can think about is we, we shouldn't have picked up the cross, which makes me a little bit confused. Surely you want a crucifix, right? I've seen the, I've seen the exorcist. Going all the way down. 
Back into the catacombs. <laughs> ah, 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 that really hurts. Luckily, there's still a decent amount of food down there, I think. Which we can grab. <clears throat> Stuck up again to go up. At least now we know why there's a ton of food down in the catacombs. Keep ourselves alive as we go backwards and forwards through this rubbish. And we go, let's avoid the bats. We are starting to run a little bit low. Can we make it? It's getting exciting. Three lives. Pew pew pew. Get down there, get down there! Uh oh. Whew! Food! I have to jump through these to get this, I guess. <clears throat> jump back up and get the rest of them. <clears throat> Not gonna risk the biscuit at this point, I'm afraid. Go. Pretty sure I can get that easily as well. That tackle. Small jump like that. Oh no! Go the other way. Q. Okay, we're kind of stocked up a little bit right now. Now I like the game for not being able to stock up on even more food. Or to waste it. Bats don't take a lot of damage. Don't do a lot of damage. Please let me... Please let me pick this up. Please... Be a nice game. I picked it up... Wait. I definitely picked it up yesterday and I'd already had the cross. So I must be able to pick it up right now. I'm confident. I'm confident. Uh, confidence is going to go on the top left. Hey, look at that. I love the noise it makes. Now there is one more item that we didn't pick up previously. Um, and I'm thinking we should probably pick it up because I don't know if we need it or not. I've got no clue. I haven't even been remotely this far in this game. Apart from, of course, yesterday. So let's go pick it up. Why not? I can't remember if it's this way or not. I can't remember which way. I think it is this way, isn't it? Because we got the hammer and the the Bible from the other side. <clears throat> so it should be over here, I think, somewhere. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Wait, 
No, I'm not sure anymore. You son of a... Oh my goodness, we need to be careful here as well. I think maybe just get those two like that. Well, little fishy, I said I wasn't going to get you, but I've changed my mind. There we go. Yee. Now I'm not so confident whether this is the right way or not. I think this is actually where the... the key was for the Bible. Oh, maybe not actually. Wait, maybe... Hmm. Okay, this is definitely where the 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 door was, the Bible door, yeah. So I think I need to go the other way. Oh, you know what? I can't, I can't I know you guys are staring at me. This is the Bible door. You guys are staring at me right now going, It's the other way! Yeah, this is the Bible door, okay. I know, I can hear you guys from here. It's been a long day. Yeah, I <laughs> can see the, see the chat. Now let's check this way then. That was the hammer, I think. Right, so it is the other way. Off we go on a little journey. The good news is that it looks like there's no more platforming sections. No more crazy platforming sections anyways, which is really the, the most dangerous thing. We go. <clears throat> little blue alien. He looks like he's getting a little bit bored with the situation. Can you effing kill him already? Down we go. Whoa! It's been a journey. Like I said, I would love to see the full map of this. See if it actually... It, it does actually feel like, on the on the outside, it does feel like it is set up as a castle with smaller towers on the left and right. And then... And then, um, you know, the big tower where Dracula's coffin is was sort of in the center, the big tower. It does feel a little bit like that. Ah, wrong way! Now we did use a few lives to get back up last time, so we're going to be looking to finish off whatever food we can find remaining. I do remember there's a lot of food in this other section that um, is going to help us out probably a bit. Get up. All right, here we go. Now we're gonna go the right way. Pew. Ah yes, this is where it is, down here on this magical block that also hurts.
Looks like we ha we've actually eaten most of the food in this area as well. Makes me slightly worried. Okay, let's get over there. I'm gonna time that pretty, pretty carefully. Yeah, here we are. We can just walk through these. Now I've got no clue what that actually is. So if anyone wants to hazard a guess. I can't even collect it. It's a booby trap item. But maybe the cross is the booby trap item. I don't know. No, I think I couldn't pick up the hammer last time. So I think this replaced the hammer. So I'm just going to assume that this was the wrong thing to pick up and the hammer was the correct thing to pick up. Okay, let's try and find some food and then let's go try and kill Dracula, I guess. <clears throat> Sounds about right. Gonna be a good one hour stream, I feel. Slightly longer. Bop, 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 bop. That little green thing looks like a little hula doll running around, but she's mostly black, so you can't really see her very well. Uh. Okay, choices. Is there food down here or not? I cannot remember for the life of me if there's food down here. This is a risk because we have to run through these enemies. <clears throat> I think this splits once it... Yeah, so it does split. But we already picked up the food down there, didn't we? Ah! Oh no. Oh no, no, no. Well, we'll grab this banana. There is there is still a place somewhere around here that has tons of food. I'm pretty damn sure. I think it's over here. Isn't there like an up and a down? Yeah, okay. Okay, yes, there is some food. Which will get us back on track here. I remember this. I remember all these screens, I just don't remember which order they're in. Should we grab this last one over here? Hmm, okay. One we cannot grab. Okay, to Dracula! Hoping that we have enough lives. Whoa. Whoa. Try not to get hit as much as possible. We only lose one life as we get out of here. That will be useful. Goodbye, little puffer fish. You were a helpful aid. Okay. I love this screen. It is the most pointless screen in the game. Just dodge everything. jump here and uh, sure enough we only used one life to get out of the catacombs now what's it gonna take to get back up to where we were I really hope we don't need that cog or whatever that thing is in in some form or fashion back up this way again we go. Back into the castle itself.
Cannot fall down that hole, or otherwise it's game over. Can't get out of there. All you can do is die. Ah, oh, no. We can't jump that. No! That was bad timing. This one, however, will be better timing. There we go. Up again. And up again. Ah, oh, this, this is not a nice screen. But luckily this time we don't need to collect any items. Just be patient, take our time. A little bit like that. Don't need to do any of these shenanigans anymore. I really hope this is going to be the end. Because otherwise, I'm not really sure what's going on. Yes! Wait, what's this? What's going on? Oh my goodness, it's like a... Oh, it's turned into a sort of a... Dodge the ball thing. What is going on? I can't get off the screen. Yeah, okay, I can't get off the screen. Oh, I can shoot! Oh my goodness. What is going on? This has turned into a... This has turned into a shoot em up. How many of these do I have to shoot? Okay, this... This took a... This took a wide right turn. My goodness. Hot? At last, the evil spectre has been expelled from the face of the earth. A new achievement in the long journey of our hero. I think they spelled achievement wrong. <laughs> Got the E and the I wrong the wrong way, but let's forget about that. I don't mind that. That's the best ending you're gonna get for the Commodore 64. Press fire. And there we go. That was Vampire. Second time's the charm. Wow. Final boss, anybody? That final boss was amazing. That was cool. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. So what was I killing? Like Dracula Dracula's balls? <laughs> His testicles attacking me or something? I don't know. But there we go, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, luckily we worked it out without bugging it out, collecting the items in the wrong order. And yeah, so uh, we'll be back next time. Something not NES or Commodore 64 related, I think. Um, yeah, so that'll be good. I do have the tape, by the way, for, for this game, but it's uh, in the storage room. Uh, you can see it right above me, just there, that's what it looks like. So yeah, I'll catch you guys later. Have a good one. Take care. Bye-bye.